May the Lord bless you guys. Evangelist Rob here of Rob Woods Ministries and want to give you some keys of what to do for Jesus and what Jesus wants to do for you in 2021. First of all, you can never take the old into the new. You've got to make room for the new. The Lord always wants to supersede outdo himself do something vibrant fresh new the lord never wants to duplicate or regurgitate an old movement an old key the lord wants to do something fresh now isaiah says a new thing shall spring forth can you not perceive it let me read this to you matthew chapter 9 verse 16 no one puts a piece of unshrunk cloth on an old garment. For the patch pulls away the garment, the tears made worse. Verse 17, listen. Nor do people put new wine in old wineskins, or else the wineskins break. The wine is spilled, the wineskins are ruined, but they put new wine into new wineskins so both are preserved i want to pray for you in about three four minutes max to make sure you have a new wineskin so when jesus pours in the holy spirit the new wine it'll sustain it won't fizzle out or leak out or abort you can contain the new thing hallelujah and go on to further maturation in christ now before I continue, if you're new, it would be an honor if you'd subscribe. I'm live every Monday, 9 p.m. Eastern New York, prophesying, preaching, praying for about an hour. But again, I want to read Matthew 9, 17 again. Nor do people put new wine into old wineskins, or else the wineskins break. The wine spilled, the wineskins are ruined, but they put new wine into new wineskin. Let me read Philippians 3.13 to you. Brethren, I do not count myself to have apprehended, but one thing I do, forgetting those things which are behind. Guys, you cannot drive a car in a rearview mirror. I mean, you could do it, but it'd be difficult. It's difficult to run back foot backwards. You've got to go forward. You've got to flush everything that took place, failures, successes, whatever, and go into the new with a fresh new not wine skin so the Lord can pour out the new wine. Now listen to this. One thing I do, Paul said, forgetting those things which are behind and reaching forward to those things which are ahead, I press toward the goal for the prize of the upward call of God in Christ Jesus. If there was one person who needed to forget his past, it was Paul. I mean, think about what Paul did BC before Christ. Think about what he was part of. He was a zealous guy who was an enemy of God, who was an enemy and a God hater. And he knew that only the grace of God could cover his past so he can go into his future. Father, I'm thanking anybody listening, watching, that they wouldn't take anything from 2020 into 2021. They would make room for the new. They would forget their past. They would press on towards the prize, towards the high calling in Christ Jesus. And man, if you've got to go to your toilet bowl prophetically or metaphorically and flush it, and say, Lord, I'm flushing everything out of me and gross, flush your toilet bowl, but just flush it, get it in. It's in the, listen, the past is in the past. You can't change the past. It is what it is. You can only go forward and build and become greater for the Lord Jesus Christ. So just some thoughts as we exit one year, go into a new year. We've got to have a new mindset also to be able to sustain our soul to contain the new thing the Lord wants to do. Hey, the Lord bless you guys. If you're new, it would be an honor. Again, subscribe. I'm live every Monday, 9 p.m. Blessings in Jesus' name.